Hello everybody, welcome to the Tokusatsu Network on YouTube. Today I'm with director Koichi Sakamoto and we're talking about Uchu Sentai Q-Ranger episode of Stinger. Thanks for coming. No problem, Thank no you. problem. So the first question is, this is a V cinema. Yep. And usually the V cinemas come out after the show is mm -hmm. complete, mm -hmm. but this is right in the middle. Yep. Why is that? Well, it's because Q-Ranger, as you know, there's a lot of characters. Not just the title says Q-Ranger, which is nine. But it's more than nine rangers in the show. So that on a TV show, uh, you can introduce them, but you cannot go into detail for individual person. So that uh, the producer decided to go to the detail in the business. Mm -hmm. so, that, uh, so that we can just more discover more of the, uh, each characters. And also, the, especially Stinger, who has a lot of background. Uh, there's a lot of story in during the TV series, but there's a part which they didn't you know, describe during the TV series. So that they decided to make the V cinema about the Stinger for the like, missing episode. Mm -hmm. So that was the reason because there are a lot of characters in the show. So by making the V cinemas, you can know more about the character. Mm. Yes. So this V cinema, yeah. if you're watching the TV show, mm -hmm. do you need to watch the V cinema? Do the stories yes, come it's, together? Yes, it's actually it's really connected. Mm -hmm. So that before I started shooting the V cinemas, I had to study really careful for all the episodes of the Q Rangers. Because this is gonna go in between episode 13, 14 ish. Okay, yes, so, that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's gonna go between 13 and 14. Hi. So that people who used to watch the Q Ranger, you can see during that time the Stinger is not in the show because he was doing this storyline. Mm -hmm. And also, this storyline also that are connected to the, uh, the future episode, episode 35 or 30 ish. Yeah. -ish. So that, uh, you know, the people who can watch this piece as individual movie. But then also you can enjoy more if you follow the series. Mm -hmm. You can just go in, so, oh, this is going to happen between this, this is going to happen between that. You can enjoy that way. Mm. Yeah. And there's also high school wars. Mm -hmm. Where does that sink in? The high school wars sink in, that it, this is a spin-off of the V cinema. So yeah. that this is actually the timeline for the uh, school wars. It's for uh, joining the uh, V cinema. Mm -hmm. So that a prequel to the V cinema is the high school wars. But then also the, uh, there's a missing storyline because this cinema is focused on the Stinger story Hi. so that they don't, you don't see other characters so much during the this cinema. Mm -hmm. So that you can see what other characters were doing when you watch the high school. Okay. Yes, so you have to watch everything. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> and you can watch the high school wars on the Toei Tokusatsu Fan Club yep. app yep. only. Mm -hmm. uh, and one of the episodes is yep. on the Blu-ray of the episode yeah, like, a, like a bonus uh, material. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Mm. So you have to watch everything. <laughs> <laughs> How did you find coming into the Q Danger universe? As you've never directed an episode of the TV show. That's correct. But uh, I was watching the show as a fan. Then when I got offered, I started watching as a creator. Mm -hmm. Then the, I watched the, uh, all the finished episode, and also that I read all the script, which is out. When, when, when Michelle Q Ranger, mm -hmm. then the, uh, you know, I got started familiar with the uh, Q Ranger universe. Then the, when I met the actors, you know, it seems like you know because I never really worked with them before, but uh, I didn't feel stranger at all because mm -hmm. uh, they are really friendly guys and uh, uh, was fun to work with. Mm -hmm. So the, usually, you know, when I meet these actors first time, you know, you sort of have a get to know period. <laughs> yeah. But this time, you know, it's from from day one. They all, yeah, what's up, you know, kind of deal. And it was kind of fun, too. Then the, uh, everybody very, very angry, or they're like, very uh, curious about the shooting action sequences. Mm -hmm. Didn't get to do too much during the TV series. So that they heard that we, you know, we do a lot of action. Yeah, that's your, that's your, that's your <laughs> so thing. So that they all say, oh, what am I going to do, what am I going to do? You know, they all want to do the action sequence, which is, yeah. you know, makes me really happy, too. So, so yeah. would you say the action sequence is like the highlight? of episode of Stinger? Uh, it is. It's, it's one of the highlights. Yeah. Uh, it's, uh, uh, it's everybody, especially Stinger, of course, uh, and Stinger and Champ. They do a lot of action sequences. Mm -hmm. And also, the, this V cinema has a guest heroine. Uh, uh, she's uh, Yuki Mamiya. Uh, she also handles a lot of action sequences, too. And she's not action actress, but uh, she's really, really, you know, like a method actor. Mm -hmm. So that when she gets into it, she really go through all. So it really helped me to also that you know get the stinger going too. So that these two guys, you know, when they fought, you know, it's really emotional and yeah. very traumatic. Mm -hmm. So it's not just action sequences, but this also has a lot of uh, drama, uh, which is sort of like a, a more like a tragedy, which you can't really do too much on a uh, you know a, a TV series because mm -hmm. it's for the kids. 
but this cinema is made for the fan of the uh, curator. Uh, of course, kids can watch it, but it's more for uh, for the people who who loves the singer mm -hmm. and for people who loves the uh, uh, curator. So the uh, uh, the storyline itself is a bit more towards adult than kids. Yeah. So it's very very dramatic and emotional. So this another highlight for this museum <laughs> is a uh, uh, friend of mine from UK, a uh, Tom. Yeah. This Tom. He's also in the movie too. Uh, he's been studying stunts and action sequences for uh, you know, filming for a year and a half. year and a half now with my gym. Yep, my Alpha gym, Stunts. Alpha Stunts gym. Then the, uh, he's been in a few other my project too, but this time, uh, you know, he's going to he played one of the law, which is uh, uh, villagers, which also required action sequences and, and acting. <laughs> I did watch my reaction faces. <laughs> So that uh, when you watch the movie, please try to spot Tom. And you can see that he's the only English guy in the film, so yeah. you can kind of see easy. I do stick out. <laughs> <laughs> but you can see him, a lot of different reactions, and doing action sequences and stuff, and so you can really enjoy it too. So that's uh, one of the biggest highlights for the movie. <laughs> I was surprised, I must say, I, I thought Stinger, uh -huh. uh, Kishi san. Uh -huh. Such a nice guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Super, it was super, super nice. As yes. soon as we came in in the morning, uh -huh. he walked up to everybody, shook mm, their hands, mm. introduced himself. Yeah, yeah. Because he played a very cool character. Yeah. You, know, you can see, you can kind of tell you know, during the character he's very cold brother, right? Mm. But uh, in person, he's very super nice. Yeah. Very warm, very friendly. You know, he's very you know uh, friendly. You know, he shake hands with everybody, and mm. you know, like you said, you know. Oh, how was that, Mars? I don't know. Yeah. That's a big smile, too. So. Yeah, and a genuine, yeah. genuine yeah. niceness. Yeah. Mm -hmm. awesome. mm -hmm. Oh, and then also he sings, too. He sings, uh, he's, a, he's a singer, he's yeah. a great singer, and he sings for uh, three different songs for uh, this film. Yeah. Uh, which is two of the songs is uh, uh, new recorded, mm -hmm. and new songs, uh, which is he's a very good singer. And I didn't know before I worked on Cure Engine, and he is coming from a singer background. And I heard that he's from singer, uh, in the singing background, then he's going to sing the song for main song for this movie. Mm -hmm. And I was really excited because uh, I was growing up watching, you know, Top Gun, Flash Dance, and Footloose, and those soundtrack films. Okay, right? all right, now I understand. Right? <laughs> so so that I'm, I'm very, very uh, you know, keen to use those songs during the movie. Uh -huh. So I don't hesitate at all, you know, because then I heard he's going to sing a song. I said, okay, yeah, so I'm going to put all his songs in the movie. Mm. Where can you buy the two new songs? Oh, it's going to be out on CD, October 25th, the same day the V is going to come out. Yes. So, so you can get down the CDs, yes. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Always. Okay. Terrific to see you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bye. Oh, how do you do Like this, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Not that you like this. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. Love you. <laughs> <laughs>